Hi guys and welcome back to another video. So today I've got five ball mastery exercises to get you hundreds of touches with all the different surface areas of both feet to keep you sharp, especially in these winter months where maybe you can't get to the pitch as often. You don't need much room today. We've just got three cones, one step apart. You can use shoes, water bottles, anything you have lying around the house. Just before we get to the exercises, I want to say a huge thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. Squarespace is aware about my website, 7mlctraining.com, and from websites to analytics to marketing tools, they're all in one place to grow your online presence and manage your business. But let's jump straight into the first exercise here. So we're going to start with the ball on the outside of the cones. We're going to drag it back towards us with the sole of the foot, transfer it to the inside of that same foot. It's a little croquetta movement across, then push it into the next gap. And then we're going to go all the way around this middle cone. Then we're going to go to the next gap, all the way along, and then back to the start. So around that middle cone, using the sole and inside of both feet, we're going to go back and forth for 30 seconds without stopping, rest for 30 seconds, and repeat this one three times. For the second exercise, we're going to introduce the outside of our foot. So starting with the ball on the outside of the cones once again. Furthest foot away from the cones on top of the ball, drag it towards us and then transfer it to the outside of the opposite foot. Touch it across, inside of the foot through the gap. Then it's a sole roll beyond that center cone. Back to the opposite foot, drag and then outside of the same foot this time, push it forwards and we're going to repeat the action. So transfer feet to the outside, around the middle cone and then to the outside. Outside, around and outside. Again, repeat this for 30 seconds, rest for 30 seconds and repeat three times. For the third exercise, we're using the inside of both feet and we're going to be really refining that croquetta movement. So transferring the ball with the inside of both feet across our body. So the first croquetta looks like this. It's very similar to the first exercise where we drag the ball back towards us. We almost stay balanced on our planting foot, transfer it to the inside between our feet and then into the next gap. And then for the second croquetta movement, we're taking a longer touch. So as we drag it back, we plant our foot down to allow us to propel ourselves to take a longer touch and to the outside of the opposite side. So then we drag it towards us, stay on our planting foot to the middle, drag it back, plant our foot, and then croquetta out to the opposite side. So look at the difference here. So we place it down so we can take a longer touch across. Again, for this exercise, go for 30 seconds without stopping. Rest for 30 seconds and then repeat this one three times. For the fourth exercise, we're going to start with the ball on the outside of the cones once again. Drag it back towards us with the sole, transfer it to the inside of our foot, croquetta into the next gap, then roll it in front of that middle cone, drag it back between the next two and out to the other side, and then we're going to repeat this pattern. 
So we're using the soles and insides of both feet to go in front and behind the cones. As with all the exercises, as you get confident with it, start to lift your head slightly so you can still see the ball and the space in front of you in your peripheral vision. And once you get confident with it, start to increase the speed. Again, go for 30 seconds without stopping, rest for 30 seconds and repeat three times. For the fifth and final exercise, we're gonna combine all the different surface areas of both feet and also add in a little skill. So this is the most advanced, but if you've mastered exercises one through four, you should get this one. So just start slowly, then increase the speed once you gain confidence with it. We're starting with the ball on the outside of the cones. We're dragging it back behind our standing foot. So it's an L drag, pushing it to the inside, place our opposite sole on top of the ball, drag it towards us, use the outside of the opposite foot to push it through the gap roll it in front of the two cones, drag it back, croquetta out to the opposite side. And as you can see, the foot is on my furthest foot again. So now we can repeat the entire pattern in the opposite direction. So L drag, outside, croquetta, and then we're back to the start. So let's go a bit quicker. Start slowly, get the pattern down and then increase the speed. Go for 30 seconds without stopping, rest for 30 seconds, and then repeat this one three times. So there we have it, five ball mastery exercises that involve all the different surface areas of both feet to keep those touches nice and sharp. Just before I go, I wanna say another huge thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. Squarespace is where I bought my very own website, 7mlctraining.com. It's become the central hub of my entire brand, allows me to put everything 7mlc training related in one place, from my blog posts to my podcast, as well as my very own seven day training programs. And if you enjoyed today's exercises and you want more ball mastery sessions to take your footwork to the next level, I'd recommend checking out Maestro and Maestro 2.0, my very own seven day ball mastery training programs. I'll leave links to those in the description box down below. But if you've ever considered building a website, and you don't know where to start, check out Squarespace. And if you use the link in my description, www.squarespace.com slash 7MLC, you can get 10% off your first website. But if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you smash the like button, hit that subscribe button for weekly training videos, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mouth, 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 mouth.